So we got Camp Hall, 18, uh, in the year 1861, the legislature of Maryland called into extraordinary session by Governor Thomas Holliday Hicks held sessions in this building owned by the Evangelical Reformed Church, now the Evangelical and Reformed United Church of Christ. After convening in the courthouse on April 26th, the senators and the delegates assembled here on April 27th. The senators on the second floor and the delegates on the third floor. A peace and safety bill was referred to a joint committee and reported favorably. But after an amendment demanding secession was rejected, the bill was, was recommitted. The legislature adjourned in September without passage of the bill because of lack of a quorum due to the arrest of a number of senators and delegates by federal order, and Maryland never seceded from the Union. On February 15, 1961, the legislature met again in this building to commemorate the Civil War session. And then it's dedicated on February 15, 1861, by the, govern the governor of Maryland, Centennial Commission. We had the Susquecentennial recently. And then uh, in three years, we're going to have the uh, 250, the quarter millennium of the uh, Declaration of Independence. And then in 18, so then here's another one. In eight, April 1861, the legislature of Maryland met here in a special, in special session. At this assembly, a bill regarded as equivalent to an ordinance of secession from the Union was, intro was introduced, but failed of passage. Okay, those are the two main ones. There's another one right over here. And we'll stop it here.